Welcome back to Johnny Chatterbox. Welcome everyone. Today's gonna be another awesome video because we are gonna react to da -da -da -da, Thailand versus Philippines final performance. Miss Universe, Universe 2020. 2020. Right, so today we're going to react on this. Yeah. And one of the subscribers have actually suggested to say that we are going to have a look on this. Yeah. So it's actually between Miss Thailand and Miss Philippines. Although we haven't even actually seen this all you see and so we are actually very excited yeah. because as you know that this um you know like miss philippines who how many how many winners are there i think there were like four winners already i reckon and hopefully yeah never know yeah. and also thailand as well who always gets through to the final round as well yeah. so i'm really rooting for this too so we're going to have a look and we're gonna check this out. Oh. So, are you started? Yeah. Okay, let's get let's started. Right. Okay. Oh, that's the beginning. Whoa. It's a swimsuit competition. I like the, like the. That's right. Jacket. Thing. There you go, guys. <laughs> Miss Thailand versus Miss <laughs> Philippines. Oh, Miss Amanda Optum. Wow, and Miss. Everyone in this room, everyone in this yeah. country, yeah. and yeah. everyone on this planet deserves to find their true happiness. Today on World Mental Health mm -hmm. Day, oh, I exactly. am ready. World Mental ready Health. She's talking about it. I'm ready to advocate and listen to you for those struggling with mental illnesses. Mm. Because if we work together, so we can achieve the yeah. universe that we can proudly say, this is the real me. Thank you. Yeah. Right. How can wow. you create a positive Chris. and lasting impact yeah, to the this world around the you? The time starts yeah. now. First of all, I need to stick to my core which is being passionate about educating people. I am a lecturer like and yes, I've been really pursuing pretty. this because this education had helped me to have that comfortable life that yeah. I and my family deserves. And I want to push people. I, wanna, uh, I want them to achieve greater things in life through me. And I know with Miss Universe, anything is possible because I am a phenomenal woman with a heartfelt beauty. Wow. <laughs> Right, this time is the swimsuit competition. Okay, before, that's actually the introductory, you know, yeah. like they're going to say about mental health. The other one was, you know, about her her goal in education as well. Mm -hmm. So, well, I can say that, right, for Miss Amanda, oh, she's so stunning, isn't yeah. she? And I really enjoyed as well as what she actually mentioned about mental health. That was really lovely. That was a very good answer as well. And also for Miss Philippines, wow, she's pretty um, witty, you see, because she yeah. can actually answer span spontaneously. And yeah, and she even mentioned a while, a while ago that she wanted to stick with her core, meaning her own platform, why she joined. So yeah, that was really, really on nice. point as well. It was very good. Well done. Yeah. So this time we're going to check on the swimsuit competition. Okay. Any questions, by the way? No. No, all right. Oops. Ooh. That's Miss Thailand. Yeah. I like the token. Yeah. Oh, when she walks. Yeah. She's got long legged legs. <laughs> oh, look at that swimsuit. Do you like the swimsuit, darling? Yeah. How oh, they actually walk. So that's Miss Thailand, Amanda Alden. Yeah. Right, this is Miss Philippines, Rubia Mateo. Category oh, is. Whoa. Oh. Category. She walks, you know. That's a nice track. Yeah, that's right. Very slow. Yeah. Yeah, but Category. really, really good as well. Yeah. Category is. Wow. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> that's pretty lovely. <laughs> Oh, Ooh, she smiled, which is great. Because in the competition, you really have to know exactly how to, you know, do your very best and how to carry yourself. Right, for the evening gown. <gasps> oh my goodness, look oh. at the gown. I love that gown. It's beautiful, yeah. isn't it? Oh. Oh. oh my goodness, I love it. Yeah. 
way she walks as well. Pretty wow. Sultry walk. Nice. Oh my goodness. Do you like that? Yeah. I love the color as well. It's pretty. And the hair actually complements with her gown. Evening gown. Oh, it's for wow. and Mateo Miss Philippines. Wow. How about that gown? Did you yeah. like that? I like the capes. Yes, that's Where right. Yeah. That's really nice gown yeah. as well. And the way she walks, pretty modest and not even rushing at all. So that's really good. Yes. Ooh. Very finesse. Wow. To give all your best. The interview portion. Right, you get to listen to this. years from today, who would have historians select mm -hmm. as the most influential woman in the 21st century and why? Please show mm -hmm. your real mm -hmm. vision. Go. So, if you ask me who I choose as the most powerful woman, I think all of us are the most powerful women because us women, we are so strong and we're so powerful. And if we put our mind into something, we can do it just as hard. Thank you. That's a pretty good answer as well. Now dismiss Philippines. Paper currency with the paper image currency. of any Filipino on it, dead or alive. Who would it be and why? If I were given the chance, I want to use the face of Miriam <gasps> Yeah, that's right. Miriam the different source and Tiago was an Ilonga, Ooh. but what I admired about her is that she used her knowledge, her voice to serve the country. And nice. I want to be somebody yeah. like her, somebody who puts her heart, her passion into action. Wow. And after all, she is the best president that we never had. That's a very good answer. I think she meant ever had, but... Pardon? As she said in her mind. Yeah, about the... Okay. Miriam Defensor, yeah. Question. She passed this away pandemic though. Has made oh, clear yeah. our priorities, I mean, Miss, uh, you know, Miriam Defensor, the president we Where never had. Oh, this pandemic. Essential. As a candidate, I know I'm not just the face of Ilu Ilu City, mm -hmm. but I am here carrying hope and wow. as a symbol of light in the darkest times. And as of the moment, I want to help my community. I want to use my strength to make an impact. And that is the essence of beauty pageant. It gives us the power to make a difference. Lovely. That's really great. Right, I'll stop from there. Well, with regards to the question and answer portions, well, that was a very good, you know, I mean, yeah. the questions were totally good. And definitely Miss Thailand and Miss Philippines, they answered the questions yeah. very well as well. The the thing that I have noticed for Miss Thailand, um, when, you know, asked the question, it was a very good question. And answer. of course, answer, what I mean, sorry, a very good answer. However, I think the substance there, there, there's substance in there, but I, I think there's actually more, more to follow, really, you see. But I didn't mean it was actually not good, but it was really, really good anyway, you see. And it really just to have do some work as well. However, for Rabia, Mateo, hmm, we could really see her heart in a way. What I mean, like when she answers spontaneously, yeah, she answered the question really, really on point. Yeah. And, you know, remember the gesture with regard to their hands and to think that she is an educator or a lecturer, apparently. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she is actually very good when it comes to, you know, speaking skills or, or, or communication skills. So, yeah, so really, really good with the answer that she actually gave, you know, to to that person who asked the questions and the question as well, but, you know, with regard to the pa paper currency. Well, Hannah, if I'll go to ask you, what, what, what kind of, you know, the image in the paper currency that you would like to put? Me. <laughs> you? Okay, why is that? Because I'm amazing. You're amazing. Oh, well done. That is really good. That means that you are very confident as well, yeah. And I have a question. Why are you amazing, darling? Because I know 
how to do stuff. Oh, bless you. <laughs> See, that's a very good answer too, because of course you're amazing because you know how to do some stuff. Yes, lots and <laughs> lots of stuff, eh? And all things are good or bad. Good. Good, definitely. Well done. See, that's how it is really, you see. The only thing that you really have to, um, you know, notice with regards to Miss Universe, they have different criteria. They have different categories as well. And and there it is that we're going to check more of this now. Definitely, we are going to go now to the crowning moment. Okay. Ooh. Wow, I was going to win this. <laughs> well done, yeah, my dog. I know the, the lady at the back, she was like, the... <laughs> oh, she's happy, that's nice. Wow. Miss Universe Philippines 2020 is. Wow. She's trying to, you know, look at her, <laughs> the other candidate. Her smiles. Yeah. I like the blue dress too. It's just a stage seater. The public because of the laptop. Wow. Ila Ila! Miss Universe for the peace. Well done. I really like her gown, darling. Yeah. It's beautiful, impeccable, remarkable. Yeah. yeah. Oh, bless her. The crown is massive. I know, it is massive. I'm well. never four years old. I hope not. <laughs> oh, she's actually having her sash on Miss Universe Philippines. Congratulations yes. to Miss Harlan. Oh, what yeah. the, um, you know, Universe and Miss Philippines Universe. Oh, I also like hers. Yeah, that was Gazzini. That was last year. Yeah, she actually joined and competed. Ooh. Oh. Well done. Right. The question. Who would be going to win or take the crown? Well done. <gasps> that was really, really good, you see. So, I bet that the two candidates for Miss Philippines and Miss Thailand. I'm really hoping that they will be able to get through, yeah. you know, to the final round, you know, and also I'm I'm just actually rooting for, for this too, Miss yeah. Philippines and Miss Thailand. And of course that you got to remember that in Miss Universe, I know it, the competition is really tough, yeah. but the main essence really is on how you are taking part actually you know taking part especially representing your own country and then later you are actually like embracing the whole the universe mm -hmm. that's why you are joining yeah and i'm really hoping that they will be able to see the essence of miss universe joining in that competition you see i know there were loads i mean i mean there are loads and loads of beautiful and elegant and of course powerful contender with regards to you know apart from them what i mean and all the representatives sending their representative for miss universe 2020 and right now i'm just really hoping that miss thailand will be able to get through at the same time mm -hmm. miss philippines so my question is who do you reckon gonna win in your own opinion do you have any i don't think do neither think? of them is gonna win maybe a different country do you reckon yeah. why is that because maybe i don't know <laughs> <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> <laughs> You're not the only two computer people there. There's also lots of others. Yeah, but but you see, in in uh, well, apparently in Miss Universe, darling, yeah, they have these different categories. Like there's from Asia, there's from Europe, there's from another, you know, um, continent as well. So in Asia, definitely, yes, in Asia, definitely, yeah. Uh, you know, they have to. Well, that yes, you you're right as well. We never know, but of course. Um, we're just really hoping that they'll be able to get through and some of the, you know, um, mm -hmm. candidates and because apart from them, to be honest, there's Miss Indonesia, Miss Vietnam, Miss South Africa, Miss um, Venezuela, everybody. So yes, yeah. and who else? All of them. <laughs> but for me, to be honest, I'm just really, you know, happy when they join. That means they're all Miss Universe. <laughs> 
to me already. <laughs> All of them are winners anyway. But yeah, well done. And I'm really happy, 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 yeah. you know, looking at them. I'm just really hoping as well that each country will be going to support, you know, their very own and of course other country as well. Or shall we say, let's just support all countries, oh shall we? So that there will be no more, you know, controversies or scandals or anything. Yeah. So, so that there will be, a, you know, a, so that the world will become a better place to live. Yeah. yeah. Well done. Well, anyway, that's only my opinion. So I'm just really hoping that Miss Universe will be going to, they don't even actually mention regarding the date really, but apparently I heard, I've been, I think it will be sometime next year, in 2021, darling, because of this lockdown, the situation thing that we're having right now, you see. Anyway, thank you very much indeed. And do you have anything to say, no. my love? No. But did you enjoy that? Yeah. yeah. So, this is actually the final performance. Yeah. So, well done, everybody. And thank you so much for joining. And Miss Talon, Miss Talon versus, versus Miss Universe. Miss but I'm just hoping that all the candidates, they are all Miss yeah. Universe already. Yeah. Okay, so thank you very much, everyone. So hopefully you are doing well. Yeah. And in this channel, don't forget to please subscribe, like this video, and comment down below for any suggestions. Yes, please. And don't forget to please put a smile on your face at every hour, every go, whatever you do. That's right. And have a great day, you see. And take care. And we love you. Thanks. And on our next vlog, thank you. Bye. Bye!